funky. Welcome back to Dark Road, everybody. Okay, so we just set fire to the tree. Has that water been all, always been there? Or is that even water? Has that always been there? I don't. I don't think so. Anyway, doesn't really matter. Uh, yeah, we just set fire to the tree, and I think we can only return tomorrow to to see what's going on with the tree. Um, is it still going to be alive? Is it dead? I, I'm assuming. I'm pretty sure that it's dead. But yeah, we we have to go check. Well, let's just put away some of this stuff, and then we should. Ha yeah, there we go. Lock picks. Molotov. We can keep that. Oxygen tank. We need this, and that can stay. Uh, nothing needs repairing. Okay, let's get out of here. We don't have a lot of time. So what I want to do is, while we still have a little bit of time, I want to go see if we can get to that wreckage now with the oxygen tank. I think we can. I'm not sure. I really hope so. Yeah, there's not a whole lot more for us to... to um, to discover in this area so oh by the way where the hell is the doctor we're looking for we've found no clue of him anywhere and that worries me because I want to kill that ass ah there we go yeah but I don't have time for you Show your face. Oh shit! Leave me alone! Leave me the hell alone! We do have... No, I don't know if this is worth it. But I want to check it out. I think we might have been here already, actually. Yeah, we have. Shit. Well, that was a little bit of a waste of time. Let's hit across. We haven't been there, I, I think. Well, we've searched that, so... Ah, uh, I don't think we had a lockpick the last time. Let's take all of that. How far are we exactly? We should be really close. I think it's right up here, actually. Okay, apparently we can't move through that. I think it's right up this way. Or not. Ooh, nice. Another mag. Where in the hell are we? Okay, you're gonna do that? Is that what you're going to do now? Okay, we need to get him away from the water. Ooh, nice, another AK mag. That is awesome to get. That is pretty much gold. Um, yeah, that should be fine. Use that. Now let's get the hell to this wreckage. This is it. Yeah, there we go. 
nice. So that is what the oxygen uh, tank is for. It's weird because we don't have any mask, oxygen mask or anything. Anyway, I'm not going to dwell on that. Oh my goodness, the music here. Was that me or was that some kind of creature? Guess we go in here. Wait, what's that? Oh, hi. Uh, where's that? Yeah, you can keep the knife. I'll take that. I don't need any of that, really. Another corpse. Who's this? A destroyed photo. And that's it? Okay, um... I, I was expecting to find a bit more. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest here. This, this was kind of a waste. Unless, of course, you didn't have the... the altercation with the Wolfman. Then that AK would be awesome. But I've already killed the Wolfman, so I've already gotten it. Anyway, at least we got an extra mag out of that, so that's cool. We've got like, what, three mags for an AK now? I think it was three, right? Yeah, these two and then the one in the gun itself. Pretty damn awesome. Okay, so basically we just need to survive this night and then head back to the tree to see what's going on there. I'm sure we've been in here already. Looted everything. Yeah. Yeah, even that. Uh, I don't want the antidote. There's another one over here. Oh shit, of course, we don't have any space. Looted that already. I actually want that trap. Ah, oh, this swamp water. Wait, wait, wait! Oh shit! <laughs> Damn! You almost grew another friend. But luckily, I think after we got our hit in, we kind of stunned him. Like, just for half a second, and he didn't manage to get it out. Oh, damn, it's so misty here. Um, I've seen that we've... Oh, we're right here, okay. Yeah, I was about to say that I've seen that we've been there, so I'm assuming there's not any underwater creature. I think this is, f yeah, that's fully stocked. Now, I have no idea what to expect from the tree. We're gonna find the doctor there, or we're gonna have to fight him. I, I have no idea what's gonna happen there. Ah oh, man, it sucks that that can't be repaired. Look at all the empty bottles we've got. That is <laughs> just wow. So yeah, we can hold three of those. Uh, the gun... I'll keep the gun for now. The handgun frame can go. Now, as you can see, these stuff... It's been lying here for quite a while. So I'm sure that we can drop loot on the ground. But we, if we do have storage, why not put it in there? Like this. Yeah, we can put all of that in there. That I'm actually going to use right now. Molotov, oxygen tank, we'll keep, definitely. This is pretty busted, so... That can go. 
We don't have any wood, do we? No, we don't. Kinda sucks, but that's not so bad. Now, how many shotgun bullets do we have? If any. We've got three. Okay. Two in the barrels, and then one extra. Um, we're gonna use that instead of the pistol for now. Oh, but then again, we do have a lot of pistol ammo. But screw it, whatever. I wanna shoot with the shotgun a bit. I enjoy the crap out of the shotgun. Okay, this I'm just gonna drop here in the corner. This is gonna be the junk corner. So... Oh, wait, we can stack that. So that can go there. Lockpick. We're obviously gonna keep the lockpick. Gonna keep all of the ammo. Let's just do this. No, no, no. I'm gonna use all the bullets I can, so... Rather save up. That should be it. We've looted this area, right? I know it's a bit late to think of that now, but yeah, 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 we've been in here. Oh, it's just some rubble. It sucks that this trader died. I liked him. Even though he never talked to us. But he was a good guy, I think. For all we know, he was a mass murderer. What is this? Rotten mushrooms. We have so many rotten mushrooms. Okay, so... Always drop one here, because it's every time almost, almost every night, something's died from that trap. It's crazy. What exactly is this eye and that? I mean, does that mean there's some kind of huge underground creature that's just everywhere? I don't know, I'm just thinking out loud. Okay, we don't need anything from this. The AK we're going to use when we go back to the tree. So I want to be safe. Because what if it happens again? We go to a new area and we can't come back here. Oh, I'm going to be so pissed. Now also, keep in mind... The radio tower. We still have to open that door and see what's inside. How the hell are we going to manage uh, to open that door without... We need to find a password somewhere. Passcode somewhere. Crosses. I, I don't remember that, to be honest. So maybe if things don't work out at the, 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 the tree, maybe we should go there. See what's happening. Otherwise, I don't know. I don't. I really don't know where to go, other than the radio tower. Cottage. There was nothing at the cottage. Damn it! I keep forgetting whenever I open the map. Uh, time pauses. So, yes, nothing at the cottage. The snail guy, he didn't give us any codes or anything. We never found any codes, except for that number in the picture that was drawn. But I don't think that is important at all. I don't know, I might be wrong. What are we going to use tonight? I'm thinking, I'm, I really want to shoot an actual, you know, an actual gun. So, let's just take out this bad boy. But, I'm not going to use it on one of the mutant dogs. Or whatever the hell they are called. I think it's mutant dogs, right? I've killed so many of them, but I... What? This is not good? Oh, I need to get there. I need to get there. Uh, 
uh, maybe this was a mistake. Why? Why did you do it? Oh, it's the tree! Oh shit! Oh shit! It was the tree! No! Oh, this is a problem! No! What the hell? Oh shit! What the hell are you? Another one! This is not good. I don't know what this means for me. My house is burning down. Two o'clock. Oh shit. Now I'm wishing I had the AK in hand already. Don't do that. Breaking down this door. Does if they come through, does that mean this area is also gonna get destroyed? Oh well, here it goes. Oh wait, now the barricade is down. Oh shit! That's exactly what it meant. Oh shit! Just run, just run. Oh, damn! Yes! Yes! What was that? Oh my goodness! Imagine I had the AK there. <laughs> oh, that would have been sick, actually. Oh shit, they're not even here. And the house is fine. Okay. Oh, what a night. What a night. Um... <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what to say about that night. You can bet your ass I'm gonna bring all the guns. After that? Mm -mm. Oh, should we only have two mags? Oh, wait, of course, and the one in the gun, like I said earlier. <laughs> okay, thank goodness we also had the armor on. Oh, we still have armor. That is awesome. Oh, are you kidding me? Wait, 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 wait. We do have somewhere. Nope. Oh no. Oh no. I'll bring that with me just in case. And the fuel. Also, just in case. Now, maybe this is working. No, nope, still covered in a thick layer of dust. We 
don't really have anything. Yeah, there's no way we're gonna be able to repair that. That really sucks. So I'm gonna bring with a second sickle. You know, just in case. Okay, that's fine. We do have the health. Okay, I wanna craft a lantern. Wait, what? Oh, okay. We need rags. I do have those. More than enough. Here we go. Yeah, that's that's great. I think that's all we need. Now let's go back there. Oh my goodness, I don't know what the hell to expect. Now, remember the tree was made out of bodies, so I'm ex I'm thinking those were the bodies that were on the tree? Okay, uh, let's start out with the pistol. We don't know what to expect. What is that noise? Is that still the fire? Can't be. They said to come back the next morning. Oops. Oh, that's a wind. Yeah, of course. Damn it. Of course I'll take that. to go down a bit more. I wish you could climb through these little windows. Ashes. Wait, I want to read that. What does that mean now? Oh, there we go. Ashes. It worked. Only ashes remain of the tree. I feel I'm approaching the end of my journey. Is it possible? Oh, damn, are you kidding me? Where's the old man? He's not even here. Maybe he's at the tree? What's that? That has to be something... Oh, okay, it's a knot. Well, I mean, we can't take it. This is the tree. The big-ass, dead-ass tree. I don't see anything though. Here we go, here we go. Oh shit! What's going on? Oh damn! This is a new location! I can't do that now. Okay, so there's no map. So maybe that means we're not gonna stay here for too long? Rope I'll take. Never know what we'll need. There's nothing. Where the hell are we going? Okay, I'm um, I decided screw the pistol. I've got the AK. A colorless goo sips from the cracks in the asphalt. Wait a minute. This is the road, isn't it? Who's that? Oh, I have a feeling I'm going to need that. Never mind, I'm going to swap those. Who the hell are you? It's the crippled old man from the village. Oh! The road home. Are you serious? The 
Look at all the bodies. That's... Wow, it's crazy. So many of them. What is this? Is this them turning into roots and stuff? Now, is this actually the end? Oh, no, we're going off the road. 25 kilometers to the nearest town. That is a long walk. Why the hell are we going back into the woods? Where are we going? Oh, this is probably why we needed the torches. I guess we are really close to the end now then. We don't have any weapons anymore. Yeah, we don't we can't even look at our inventory. Shit, where the hell do we go? Is this it? Looks like this is it. I have no idea if I'm going the right way. I really hope I'm going the right way. Okay, it's opening up a bit. Here we go, here we go. Oh! <laughs> Telephone lines! Damn! The one time I don't want to be interrupted, it happens. Damn it, man. Okay, so... Yeah, where the hell are we going? I'm assuming we have to follow the telephone line, right? Because that brings you back to civilization. So let's just keep on following. I really want my AK. Yeah, look at that! Civilization! Okay, now what the hell, who the hell are we going to find here? But isn't this our apartment building? I remember a vision like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I remember this. Maybe we go in here? Nope. Neighbor. My first floor neighbor. We'll speak to her. Or is she dead? Good day to you. Oh, okay. She's alive. Thank goodness. There we go. This is our apartment. Dupa. This is my staircase. No, not yet. I thought it was the doctor. Pleased to see you, mister. Haven't seen you in a while. Yeah. It, it's been a while. Apparently someone was too lazy to bring it down down the stairs and throw it in this trash. Yeah, so nice of them. Old rug. Guessing we have to move up. Scribbles. It's probably the work of the kids from the neighboring apartment block. Them damn kids. The store seems to be blocked from the other side. Why the hell would I want to barricade that? Look at the cracks in the wall. Ah, oh, our apartment! What are we gonna find in here? Home sweet home. Hell yes. 
It's my wardrobe. Take off your coat. Hell yeah! We've been wearing that coat for way too long. Some note is lying on the table. I've made you some soup. Heat it up. Ooh. Old trusty caster. There's still some soup in the pot. The smell fills the entire kitchen. Oh yeah. Cook. I grab the largest dish from the closet under the sink and pour myself a bowl. It's not much, but it's enough. I don't remember the last time I've eaten a home dinner. Mmm, mmm, tasty. <laughs> Wash your dishes, man. Okay. The bathroom, yes. Washing machine, the Frenia washing machine. I spent two days in the queue to get it. Not worth. Not worth. Two days? Two days? No way. You'll never see me do that. Oh shit! <laughs> Good boy. Oh my goodness. Pit him again. Yeah, there we go. Fabric. I don't know why we need to take that. My TV set. The black and white Reuben. A real luxury. Unfortunately, it's broken. Why the hell is that? What? A flashlight in the TV? More cupboards. Wardrobe, sorry. Bedroom key. Fabric. More fabric. Oh, I thought I could throw the fabric over him. Go to sleep or something. Yeah, let's leave on the light. Use the key. my bed. The white crumpled sheets look as if it's just as if I've just woken up. At last. I feel my sore legs buckling underneath me. My body becoming heavy and overwhelmingly lethargic. It was a grueling journey. 38 days of human tor torment. Hell yeah. A sedating warmth washes over me. A warmth of, a warmth of security and happiness. Oh, I know that feeling. When you get back to your own bed after a while. Damn, that's the best feeling ever. What's he doing? Taking off his shoes? Yeah, look at that. Comfy. Now you just need your wife. What a journey. And they're not even going to explain how we got there? Bliss. The rustle of the woods stretching away to the horizon kept the stranger awake for a long time. So we're still just known as the stranger. <laughs> Eventually fatigue washed over him and the man fell into a deep, much desired dream. Oh no. This doesn't sound good. Burning the tree opening the, opened the road home for many anguished inhabitants of the forest. Only three outcasts dressed in old rags and scraps lamented over the, its charred remains. Me, the old man, and maybe the doctor. The doctor, fearing revenge of the man dressed in scarecrow costume, disappeared deep into the wilderness. The unfathomable visions visions that haunted him eventually led the local physician to the edge of madness. In the end, however, they became obvious transmissions and the forest became his new home. Damn it, so he's still alive. I wanted to kill that asshole.
Before the villagers left their homes in search of food, they rushed into the heart of the woman living with the ki chickens to reinvigorate themselves before the journey. They did not satisfy their hunger completely, but nevertheless, they left quite content. The chicken lady, deprived of the company of her beloved chickens, filled with excruciating despair and burning hatred towards the villagers, stayed in the abandoned village and continued tending to her sister. However, her determination was not met with appreciation. After many weeks of fighting off starvation, the chicken lady died, thus becoming her beloved sister's final meal. Damn! That's nasty! That is very nasty. I wonder if they're gonna say anything about the mushroom lady. Wow, they give you more than enough time to read that. The boy with the violin buried his parents and returned to the silo. He threw away his gramophone and his violin. He started to listen to the sound of the forest, which calmed his scattered thoughts. One day, he left his home and went towards the trees, following his mother's voice. Shouldn't do that. Your mother's crazy. Piotrek never finished building his rocket. He remained in the woods, dreaming about space travel. Could, so, could I have helped all these people to achieve their goals? The barricaded cottage at the swamp became a prison for the three children. The oldest boy kept lock, locked in his room following his escape attempt, would long remember his journey through the woods and the visit in the house overgrown with white mushrooms. I think, um, I think I messed up. I think I could have helped all these people. <laughs> now, I, now I feel kind of bad. When the stranger took the boy from the mushroom infested hut, the old lady owned the place, who owned the place, fell into a deep slumber. When the door to the house opened again after many weeks, only a rocking chair overgrown with white mushrooms was found inside. So, she basically became a mushroom herself. What about... Oh, wait. <laughs> we killed the snail. So, yeah, there's no, no talk about him. And what happened to the mother? They only talked about the three children and the other boy. Where's the mother? Acid Wizard Studio, thank you so much for this experience. This was absolutely awesome. I really enjoyed the hell out of it. Um, everything was great. The sound design, Arthur Cordes. I hope I'm not butchering that name. Awesome work. Damn, the sound in this game was amazing. Thank you, everybody, for watching. I hope you enjoyed this playthrough with me just as much as I did, because I enjoyed the hell out of it. If you enjoyed it, please remember to subscribe. And stay tuned for my next series, which should be coming soon. I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you have a great night.